Ang kwicho. Please be seated. Le président, veuillez vous asseoir. The court is now in session. Je déclare l'audience ouverte. Today, the chamber continues to hear the testimony of expert Won Vuti. Le témoin Won Vuti. Ms. T. S. Huang, please report the attendance of the parties and other individuals to today's proceedings. Personne à l'audience d'aujourd'hui. Greffier, Mr. President, for La today's Greffier, proceedings, President, all parties to this case are present. Present. Mr. Nuntier is present Monsieur in the holding cell downstairs. Dans la he has waived his right to be present in the courtroom. The waiver has been delivered to the Greffier. The expert who is to conclude his testimony today, Mr. that is Mr. Mouboutier, is present in the courtroom. And we don't have any reserve of witness for today. Nous n'avons pas de témoins de réserve aujourd'hui. President, thank you, Mr. Chief Sewan. Le président. The chamber now decides on the request by Noon Chief. Merci, Madame la Greffière. The chamber has received a waiver from Noon Chief. Présenté par Noon Chief. Dated 14 December 2016. Which states that due to his health, there is headache, back pain. He cannot sit or concentrate for long, and in order to effectively participate in future hearings. He requires to waive his right to be present at the 14 December 2016 hearing. Having seen the medical report of Nunchi by the duty doctor for the accused and the ECCC dated 14 December 2016, which notes that today Nunchi has a lower back pain when he sits for long. I recommend that the chamber shall grant him his request so that he can follow the proceedings remotely from the holding cell downstairs. Based on the above information and pursuant to Rule 815 of the ECCC internal rules, the chamber grants Nunchi his request to follow today's proceedings remotely from the holding cell downstairs where an audio visual means. The chamber instructs the AV unit personnel to link the proceedings to the room downstairs so that Nunchi can follow that applies for the whole day. And before I hand the floor, to the defense team of Nunchia. Once again, the chamber would like to remind Mr. Mr. Mouti for coming to testify in uh, this courtroom. Yesterday, your responses were uh, clear. However, due to the abundance of your technical uh, terminology, which is a bit uh, difficult for interpreters. Since uh, it has to be interpreted into English and French. So please, uh, Mr. Munbuti, speak slowly for the sake of the interpretation and then your uh, response could be interpreted in full. And when you read uh, the numbers, please leave a slight pause between each number. And we uh, will try to have our uh, proceeding uh, go smoothly. I'd like now to hand the floor to uh, the co-counsel for Nunchir to put questions to the expert. Before that, I noticed that the international deputy co-counsel is on his feet. Uh, do you have the floor? Uh, thank you, uh, Mr. President. Just one short preliminary matter. Um, uh, as the chamber is aware, um, you obtained from the expert a uh, a new study relating to Krang de Chan last week that was made available to the parties. Uh, a translation was provided um, to us yesterday. Um, uh, I think a, a formal request is necessary to, to, to admit that um, so that the witness can be, can be examined on it. Um, and I'm not sure uh, whether that is whether the documents have already been admitted or, or not, si that seemed to be the intention. But in any event, I wanted to make sure that there was a record that 
Nous sommes requesting the admission of the uh, new Krantachan study uh, as a document, a uh, piece of evidence that has just been completed. It obviously meets the criteria for 874. Um, but um, uh, we would seek a ruling before the parties begin their examination. Any other comments from other parties regarding the request made by the uh, deputy co-prosecutor? First, uh, the lead co-lawyers for civil parties? D'abord, le co-avocat principal pour le parti civil. Pas d'observation, Monsieur le Président. No remarks, Mr. President. And Councillor Copper, you have the floor. Le président Maire Coupeux, vous avez la parole. Just before you say something, I know Avant that with the other study, uh, if I remember correctly, we admitted excerpts, not the whole study. Si is the request now to, to um, uh, admit the whole study, or is there some specification? Dans son intégralité, l'accusation, voulez-vous préciser? Avez-vous des extraits? I think one of the reasons we proceeded that way before is that we had. Hard, hard copies, um, 30, 30 volumes that had not been electronically scanned. Um, so I think that was part of the logistical reason behind that. It, it certainly, I think, would be sufficient to, to admit the same material. But in this case, we have an electronic uh, copy. Il les mêmes my co-counsel is telling me to slow down. Uh, we already have an electronic copy, copy so in order to separa separate it, I, uh, logistically, I think that would be, be more work. Um, uh, we have no intention of translating anything beyond the same materials that were translated in relation to the Cheng X study. But I think Rien que ce qui a logistically, déjà été I don't see any reason to split apart the, the document. Mais sur le plan logistique, je ne pense pas qu'il fasse qu'il soit nécessaire de diviser le document, de le scinder. Monsieur le juge Lavergne, vous avez la parole. Oui, euh, dans ce cas, monsieur le procureur, est-ce qu'il ne serait pas case, suffisant simplement de demander à ce que les parties qui ont été traduites soient déclarées recevables plutôt que l'ensemble des documents Est-ce que vous nous dites que vous n'avez pas demandé la traduction du reste Peut-être simplement se limiter à ce qui a été traduit, c'est-à-dire, je crois, l'introduction but uh, it's only what de, was uh, page introduced, that is the introduction and a number of pages. I think that is what should be admitted into evidence. Uh, Judge Laverne, I have, I have no objection if, if that's what we do. Le juge, that, that would involve separating, though, um, the elect, dire um, faut a file that exists electronically in one dossier electronique um, existe. A file right now. I, I have no objection if the court uh, wishes, wishes je to do that. Um, si la but peut le faire. This is not the first instance in which we have a voluminous le cas a document, nous nous and face un the translations are limited to the most pertinent parts that are necessary for the parties to, to understand. So I think that's a matter for the court's discretion. Uh, I, I don't have any objection e either way. Et je pas J'aurais peut-être besoin d'une précision parce que je ne suis pas entièrement sûr de savoir exactement ce qui a été traduit. Je crois que ce qui est certain, c'est que l'introduction a été traduite. Mais après, ce que les parties peuvent éventuellement nous indiquer si d'autres extraits de ce document ont été traduits. Okay, thank you, Judge. I'll give you my understanding Merci, le juge. Je vais um, ma of what has been translated, qui a été uh, and that is based on my uh, reading of the documents, because the translation document. we were provided yesterday doesn't uh, have specific indications of the corresponding Khmer pages. I suspect that the final version posted will have that. But there were, there are three final, separate um, uh, documents um, that were notified uh, and made available on the shared materials drive by the chamber. Par la chambre, sur le um, there is partagé. a one-page uh, analysis list an analyse, uh, that is Khmer 0135 That appears to have been translated. Uh, there is a 
another one page il y a une autre page intitulée liste remains, des restes conservés Khmer, C'est là ma compréhension des parties traduites. Voilà. Est-ce que les parties confirment leur compréhension de ce qui a été traduit what the prosecutor has said as having been translated. Um, yes, um, thank you, um, Mr. President, Judge Laverne. Merci, Good morning. Mr. President. Um, Judge Laverne. Clearly, the request uh, to have uh, admitted into evidence uh, the documents relating to the study for document Uh, is a valid request. As a matter of fact, uh, I will be asking questions based on these documents uh, to the expert. Um, however, it's a, it's a bit unclear to me um, exactly how many separate uh, documents we have. Uh, what we do have is a, um, so far, a 17 c'est 17 pages uh, traduites so far, I think without, uh, any ERNs. à ce jour, sans ERN. Uh, I think it's also of of Il s'agit également d'une traduction informelle uh, de divers is, documents. Uh, a translation of, uh, the introduction. Plusieurs traductions de l'introduction. Um, There is an overview of Il y a également un aperçu de ce qu'on appelle « bones » in the criminal center Krankachan. I'm not sure whether that is a separate document. It appears pas si not document to séparé. be so. Um, Cela ne semble pas être le cas. Then there's also a document called an document analytical, list analytical list on the torture and killing markings on, on the remains from 1 to 1904. And then there is indeed one Sample uh, translation or translation rather of a sample page uh, on one particular un échantillon de page. Um, cranium or skull, um, number un crâne 0001. Particulier, um, le numéro 0001. It appears to have the exact same format as um, the descriptions le même used. Format in the Chang X study. Que la description utilisée um, dans l'étude de Chang X. What we found um, in the library uh, of, as a, of a physical copy Ce que nous this avons morning trouvé dans la bibliothèque is, uh, this one en termes de copie physique ce book, matin. C'est cet ouvrage qui a trait à um, Krang Tachan. There are a few parts in it which um, I might be referring to as well when je ferai référence uh, à certaines de ces pages um, lors de l'interrogatoire de l'expert. Uh, Mais en général, same, um, il serait logique de suivre la in, même méthodologie en respect dans la description des documents, comme l'a fait la Chambre en ce qui concerne les documents de Chang Ek. Yes, we agree that Cela dit, uh, all documents should oui, be admitted nous sommes d'accord pour la recevabilité de tous les documents. Juste le tous les documents que vous avez mentionnés, à l'exception du dernier, feraient uh, partie de ce que le procureur appelle étude de Krang Tachan, et qu'il veut voir déclaré recevable. Est-ce yes, exact Nous parlons de la même chose, mais dans la traduction, c'est un peu difficile d'établir si c'est un seul document. Les documents seraient exacts. 
mais pour la traduction, il est difficile de dire s'il s'agit d'un document distinct, quatre ou deux documents distincts. Juchwenz. Et quel est le dernier well, document fact, I, I, I dont the vous parlez Maître Coppens, j'ai oublié de mentionner um, une, in, in un tableau à la page 60 portant sur les ossements conservés. These are all separate documents. Il s'agit des documents um, séparés. So again, it would make sense Parmi tous les documents admis en preuve concernant Chang'ek, il serait donc um, utile de suivre la même procédure. Mais je But laisse cela à la discrétion de la Chambre. Et nous ne faisons pas objection à la requête. Maître Copé, est-ce que, euh, au-delà des pages qui ont été traduites, vous pourriez nous donner des références des pages que vous souhaitez utiliser et qui n'ont pas été traduites Ou est-ce que vous souhaitez le, le faire plus tard Maître Copé. Il serait pratique de le faire plus tard. Nous avons recherché ce livre hier, mais la bibliothèque était fermée. Nous, nous l'avons retrouvé ce matin. Il y a des références au projet de cartographie du CDCAM, un document qui est au dossier. Je fais un Est-ce que le dernier document a été admis en preuve ou non Je me perds un peu. Le livre dont vous parlez, Maître Coppe, je pense que c'est le cas. Il y a une version scannée sur le répertoire partagé, mais voici une copie physique de Kanka Chang. Je fais un Est-ce un document supplémentaire devant être admis en preuve séparément relatif à l'étude du crâne de Kranta Chan. Maître Coppe, c'est la page d'échantillon. La première page relative à un examen de crâne a été traduite suivant le même format que l'étude de Chang'ek. Toutes les pages sont des descriptions de crâne. Et il y a des photos également dans cette étude. À la fin de l'ouvrage, on fait référence aux chiffres tirés du projet de cartographie du CDCAM, mais ce document se trouve déjà dans le dossier, est déjà versé au dossier. Le président Maître, Guissé, vous avez la parole. Merci, M. le Président. Bonjour, bonjour à Thank tous. You, Mr. Euh, je Good constate morning. simplement que les difficultés que nous avons aujourd'hui euh, résultent de la précipitation euh, dans laquelle nous avons dû examiner ce document. En tout état de cause, euh, du côté de la défense de Pius euh, nous souhaitons que euh, soient admis simplement les parties euh, de cette étude de Kringtachan qui ont été traduites. Euh, ça limitera les difficultés et euh, on saura exactement à quoi on fait référence. Évidemment, lorsque nous la version définitive of course, uh, de we'll cette have to copie de courtoisie de traduction. Il y aura de meilleures références et ce sera plus facile pour les parties de savoir à quelle partie ça correspond. Et en tout état de cause, nous souhaitons que ce soit simplement versé en preuve les parties, les parties traduites, donc accessibles à toutes les parties malgré le peu de temps.
Le président, je vais passer la parole au juge Lavergne pour rendre une décision orale sur ce sujet. Vous avez la parole. Oui, merci, Monsieur le Président. Merci, Mr. Donc, Président. À, à ce stade des débats, la Chambre décide in, uh, de déclarer recevable les pages de uh, l'étude concernant Krenkachan, qui correspondent aux pages qui ont été traduites, qui sont donc disponibles à partir, à savoir l'introduction de l'étude, uh, de tableaux, ainsi qu'un well exemplaire d'une étude d'un crâne. Or a copy si of uh, la défense, study, uh, si les équipes de défense souhaitent uh, demander ou uh, souhaitent utiliser d'autres like documents de cette étude, la demande pour être en fait en cours, cours d'audience. Voilà, j'espère que cela est assez clair. Le président, Maître Coupe, vous avez la parole. Yes, thank you, Mr. President. Maître Coupe. Uh, good morning, uh, Mr. Expert. Um, Merci, Monsieur le Président. Bonjour, Monsieur l'Expert. Uh, Je suis le co-avocat uh, international like de Nunchia. J'aimerais vous poser des questions ce matin. Um, just to give you a, a heads up, I have two main. Pour vous donner un aperçu, j'ai deux um, sujets principaux. About, uh, Le premier porte sur uh, les chiffres. Total numbers of, uh, human remains chiffres total des restes humains And, conservés. Uh, my second subject is, Mon deuxième sujet, uh, uh, c'est la détermination des traumatismes uh, relevés sur les différents uh, bones. crânes ou ossements. Um, yesterday you confirmed and, and we can read it also vous avez confirmé, in, um, in the various Chang Ek documents dans les différents documents that, de, de Chang Ek, um, in total uh, 6, au total 426 6426 um, were preserved humains ont um, été préservés in the documents we can see that you and your team dans le document nous pouvons voir que vous et votre équipe Um, 6, uh, crania. avait décrit 6426 crânes. Ma première question est la suivante. Um, before you started your, uh, study, Avant de you, commencer votre étude, uh, had estimated to find around six, around 7, vous avez estimé um, trouver environ 7500 um, restes humains. The, the number of 6,426 is therefore less than you initially in 2013 expected. Uh, can you au explain to the Chamber why you think that was or what your conclusions are in this Thank you, Council, for the question. Réponse. Allow Merci, Maître, pour cette question. Je vais préciser the different, the difference in, uh, numbers. la disparité entre les chiffres. Le chiffre obtenu après avoir And mené l'analyse médico-légale. Avant de répondre à votre question, of, uh, je vais vous donner des éléments de contexte. Initially, when we, uh, Started Au départ, our research, lorsque nous avons initié la recherche, the, the nous, the nous avons étudié and le contexte qui prévalait autour du site de crime et nous avons obtenu un chiffre. That is when those, uh, uh, were start in a wooden stupor, and after 1983, nous avons analysé, nous avons compté les crânes entreposés dans the, un stupor uh, en bois et après 1985, il y avait 8985 ossements. Par la suite, en 2006, lorsque je suis allé visiter le stupor, le stupor était construit en dur. J'ai demandé aux gestionnaires quel était le chiffre des ossements. Une estimation a été faite. 
car il n'y avait pas un décompte clair. Et l'on m'a dit que le chiffre que le chiffre était à 7500. C'est ce chiffre que nous avons annoncé lors de notre Later analyse on, médico-légale de la conservation. Par la suite, we, lorsque nous avons effectué l'analyse médico-légale par la conservation, interruption de la juge fait début inutile, Either don't Monsieur do it le témoin, or put on record what si you are using. Photos, Otherwise, it doesn't help. Il faudrait so nous dire clairement de quel document vous parlez, sinon votre déposition ne sera pas utile. As, now, vous pouvez dire que l'expert nous a présenté une photo. Sorry, no. If you, if you tell me the reference of the photo. Ceci, ceci, ceci. Et puis, vous pouvez parler du contenu de la photo. Et vous pouvez également donner la référence. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Thank you, Mr. President. I'm going to take advantage of this to simply to ask the expert to really slow down because it's very, very difficult for the interpreter. Et en ce même problème, je sais, c'est compliqué. I also have that the same shortcoming. So, but if you could slow down, that would be good for all parties. So please identify the photo for the record. Je veuillez donc, s'il vous plaît, Monsieur le témoin, for the written record. ou identifier la photo au fin du transcript écrit. Bart Samakun, expert. Thank you. My apology that I spoke uh, very fast. Merci et toutes mes excuses. Let me continue. Je the difference in number <laughs> is because of the fact that The, when the remains were re transferred to the concrete stupa, those remains were counted. On a those remains, including the small pieces, were counted. One uh, cranium was uh, broken into pieces, and they counted those pieces together. We, the experts, had to fit the pieces together to make a complete cranium. Then we counted as one. And let me tell you, Mr. Lawyer, when we combined and combined the pieces into a cranium, we spent a lot of time doing it, and this document, this photo was given to you in the electronic email already. As you can see, the large pile which I was pointing, which I'm pointing to, uh, could only make up of uh, ten crania. crania. That is why the, there, there were differences in number. This doesn't work. If you refer to a photo, the photo needs to be identified. Either page, whatever, in the study, or something. Otherwise, whoever reads the record doesn't know what you have shown and what you are referring to. It might be easier to see the photo. No, no, it's, uh, maybe he's referring to other photos. Let me not inter intervene here. Autre, uh, photo, donc je n'interviens pas. Peut-être, puisque il y a eu des well, communications uh, avec des référencements uh, sur le SMD, uh, je réitère la requête que j'ai formulée hier, à savoir que peut-être qu'il serait bon de donner à l'expert les éléments que nous avons en nous dessus avec le ERN, donc il faut que les éléments que nous avons en nous dessus avec le ERN, donc il faut que les éléments que nous avons en nous dessus avec le ERN. Um, so, President Si Huang, I told the graphiers already about uh, the document and also I instructed uh, that uh, the experts should be given the documents with the EON number and identification number. So now, please uh, deal with the matter, greffier. Je prie à présent le greffier de voir ce qu'il en est. President, please uh, resume your questioning. President, um, yes. Um, 
I, I think um, I was able to uh, follow the gist uh, of your answer. Um, Monsieur le témoin, je crois avoir été en mesure de suivre l'essence de question. votre réponse, um, et j'aimerais vous poser une question de suivi. Your estimation of 7,500 was, if I understand correctly, um, based upon the number of 8,985, um, which um, was apparently the result of the uh, excavations by des travaux d'excavation effectués par les autorités vietnamiennes entre 1981 et 1983. Est-ce que c'est exact? The, the figure of 8,985. Réponse, le chiffre 8,985 is the figure given by the Office of Propaganda and Culture of Phnom Penh. At the time, no other authorities went to excavate or exhume the remains. At the time, there were some individuals that went to exhume the remains to find the gold and to find uh, clothes so that they could use and make use of make use of them. So my uh, figure uh, was based on what we uh, based on the figures that. Uh, uh, existed in the past. So if, if, uh, if I uh, may summarize, Donc si je um, résume. in doing the evac excavations 1981-1983, um, sources say that 8,985 human remains que 8,985 um, uh, based on this number you à partir de ce had chiffre, an estimate vous, vous avez of effectué une finding around 7,500 um, human été remains. Retrouvés, However, at the end of humain. your study Toutefois, in December 2015, you concluded uh, that you vous had avez preserved uh, que not 7,500, but rather 6,426 crânes. Is that a correct summary? Est-ce que j'ai bien résumé la situation? Uh, I, I heard something different um, from the witness, so perhaps he can clarify in his answer. I heard him say that, that um, he when he was asked to do the study, he obtained an estimate of the then number from people at Chiang Ek, not that he came up with that 7,500 number himself, but that's something he can clarify. That is indeed the case, but his subsequent answers, le témoin, but maybe that was my interpretation, um, but let me ask you concretely, was the number of 7,500 that was given to you est un chiffre qui vous a été donné à partir du chiffre 8985, le chiffre d'origine, ou pas. Thank you. Before I respond to your question, let me recall of the background. Un petit peu quelques Before éléments de contexte. the remains were collected Avant and placed in the wooden stupa, no one conserved stupa. those remains. En bois, personne ne s'occupait de la conservation de ces remains fell down and fell down into uh, the mass grave. And some others were eaten by cattle or cows. Some bones were eaten by those cows and cattle, and again, some remains fell in back into the mass graves. The reasons that I said there were 
la raison pour laquelle j'ai cité is ce chiffre de 5 000, 7 500, c'est parce que lorsque le stupa a été érigé, en 1987 et 1988, c'était le moment où les remains ont été comptés et le nombre a été effectué. Et c'est à ce moment-là qu'on a abouti au chiffre de so 7 500. Donc, la différence dans le nombre is because of the fact that uh, at the beginning those remains début, small pieces were also counted ossements, des petits fragments and later on we could uh, come to a conclusion there were 6,426 remains. Um, I think I understand um, but the Mais question then is still open. Um, reste encore sans réponse. About, um, la question uh, se pose conclusion that de savoir sur quelles sources vous vous êtes fondé pour définir que entre uh, les travaux d'exhumation de 1983 et 1985 uh, restent humains um, ont été trouvés. Let me ask it differently. We have tried to je reformule. Nous avons effectué des recherches pour essayer de trouver des documents sous-jacents qui viendraient corroborer et qui viendraient appuyer la conclusion selon laquelle 8985 restes humains ont été retrouvés en 1981 et 1983. Quelles informations avez-vous à propos de ces travaux d'exhumation But, uh, regarding the figure of 8985, et ce que nous avons trouvé, c'est que le chiffre, the result of the addition était en of réalité the le résultat d'une somme entre shown at the mass graves. I cannot recall which page. Uh, dans les fosses communes, je ne sais plus à quelle page exactement what I have just explained. on retrouve l'explication que je suis en so train de vous donner. There are many pages Parce qu'il y a maintes pages showing, uh, the figure in qui présentent des chiffres document. dans I mon document. Do not recall Et je ne me souviens which pas page exactement uh, it is. du numéro But de la page I have included pertinente. Uh, Mais the j'ai fait book, mention de ce chiffre de façon électronique. L'inventaire enregistre l'analyse et les chiffres found. que nous avons trouvés. Nous, nous sommes également adressés au CDCAM pour that, mener nos recherches. Et en marge de tout cela, nous avons aussi us. effectué des analyses des photos Moreover, qui nous ont été remises. Plus, the documentary, the film documentaries at, at des documentaires the filmés à ces We endroits. Examined the mass nous graves avons examiné well. également Some experts les fosses asked communes, me certains about experts the m'ont demandé quelles étaient les quelle était l'origine des divergences uh, entre uh, the number, ces chiffres et les discordances. Et j'ai expliqué pourquoi il y avait des we, variations. Uh, C'est à cause de cette question qu'il a to make the preservation and we need, we need to study the figures uh, carefully. Um, I understand what you're saying, but first of all, that Maître doesn't change Kruppe. the fact. Très bien, je comprends ce que vous dites, mais ça ne change pas le fait qu'il n'y a aucune source qui appuie ce chiffre de 1985. En outre, il existe également un rapport effectué par un scientifique de Nouvelle-Zélande, 
Nancy Rogan O'Beaven. Dr. Beaven, I have to say, um, she Le wrote a report. Dr. I'm Beaven. sure you're Beaven. aware of that report. Cette personne a rédigé un rapport. Slash, uh, uh, 10,643, and it's called du E3 uh, Evalu et c'est intitulé of the, uh, Evaluation conservation of victims de at la conservation des project. victimes and, sur le site uh, de Chong Eng, uh, le champ de la mort, 18, page 18, which is English ERN 0123 and Khmer 0123 she says, and uh, let me let me LD, quote you, uh, uh, quote her. Sorry, um, there is no explanation about the different number of crania reported at different times. Entre le nombre de Some of the ideas about the difference in the numbers are that pas animals may have eaten some of the bones while they were in the wooden stupa. Manger um, tandis qu'ils étaient à l'intérieur du um, stupa en bois. Do you agree with that conclusion that Est-ce que vous êtes d'accord avec cette day, conclusion selon um, laquelle, au bout really du compte, il n'existe pas vraiment d'explication Um, I'm not sure which part of the question you heard. Um, Je ne sais pas Mr. Wittes, did you, si did vous avez entendu l'intégralité de ma question, Monsieur le témoin. Est-ce que vous avez out entendu out la citation que je viens de vous lire My apology, Je m'excuse. There was a, a technical glitch in my equipment. I did not hear the, the whole statement you made. Oui. President, Council, uh, please uh, repeat your Veuillez question and also the quotes. Mm. Yes. Um, what I was reading to you, uh, Mr. Expert, is um, an excerpt from a report of someone I'm sure you are well uh, familiar with, um, a New Zealand, uh, New Zealand scientist, uh, uh, Dr. Beaven, and uh, she wrote um, in her report, E3-10643, uh, on page 18, page 18 English ERN 01235398, she said there is no explanation Elle dit qu'il n'existe aucune explication pour justifier la différence entre le nombre de crânes qui ont été référencés à différents moments. Certaines des explications pour expliquer cette différence entre les chiffres font état d'animaux qui auraient mangé une partie des ossements tandis qu'ils étaient à l'intérieur du stupa en bois. Êtes-vous d'accord avec ma conclusion Proper explanation selon laquelle il n'y a pas de bonne explication et d'explication appropriée pour expliquer la différence entre le chiffre de 6,985 et votre conclusion finale selon laquelle vous avez réussi à préserver 6,426 restes humains. I agree with what you said about the difference in number. There is no uh, clear evidence showing the exact number, but let me explain. Nancy, the expert, came to conduct a study on the preservation. She met me and some new staff members, Ainsi que and I du uh, conducted Et some of my study uh, since the, the beginning. Moi, I met Ning Sai and uh, conducted a study with him since the beginning when the scouts 
and remains were exhumed. La personne yes. qui est avec laquelle nous avons effectué uh, Some bones were eaten by uh, animals and some fell back into animaux, the mass graves. Dans les fosses communes. Yes, when, and also when the, the remains uh, were Et removed from the wooden stupa and put in the concrete stupa, we also examined uh, very carefully. In 1987 and 1988, there was a group of uh, uh, Vietnamese uh, medical doctors came to examine the remains. They gave uh, the numbers, they gave numbers to the remains, and uh, some figures uh, could arrive at more than 7,500. Au total, on est arrivé à dépasser le chiffre de 7,500 dans le décompte. As I have explained, we have a photograph Comme je vous the remains and also the les ossements. drama. Et nous avons également we have a photograph. And if you want to uh, find out the si figure, you can go to the electronic mail. And you can see vous pouvez reprendre le email about the figure that uh, we have cleaned uh, uh, and also the figure that we have studied the trauma. Le I understand what you're saying. I'm not saying that you are wrong. Um, but um, support for, for what you're saying might even be found um, in all fairness in E3 slash um, 10,766, which is an exhaustive uh, list of the preserved remains because um, that says that 6,426 skulls were found. However, however, at the same time, uh, you identified, or your team has identified, uh, for instance, at number three, um, uh, category uh, the humerus, uh, the, um, I believe the upper arm, that there are uh, 7,708 right Humorous Il y a plus and 7,673 left humorous. Um, so that could be an indication that uh, the original estimate gauche. might not have been far off. If my understanding of anatomy is, is correct, of course. Um, however, that doesn't change the fact, Mr. Witness, um, that ne pas le fait, um, le témoin, que Nancy Beaven in her Nancy report. Beaven, dans son rapport, um, also mentioned that um, in 1988, um, uh, Vietnamese forensic workers uh, came to Chiang Ai to clean the bones uh, from the old uh, wooden stupa uh, before they put uh, the bones into the new uh, memorial stupa. Um, again, I'm, I'm referring to her report, same page, 18. Uh, and this is what intrigues me, um, Mr. Expert. It's, she says the Vietnamese or the Viet forensic put identification numbers on many of the skulls. Um, the identification numbers, for example, uh, IK 4110, IK 443, and IK 3283 are not referenced to any catalog that, that has been found. But What's interesting is that those Vietnamese forensic workers um, only went up to the Vietnamien number of 4,576. Um, ne sont can you explain that the identification of the crania by the Vietnamese in 1988 only went up to 4,576? n'a trouvé que 4576 crânes. Bat de khiem lực lực mốn min ou plutôt ossement. Corrige ta phrase. I have told already that there was the réponse. code number used by Comme je l'ai dit the Vietnamese medical 
doctors and the code numbers par les médecins vietnamiens were large in amount compared to those used by de... Nancy she came for just a month so she did not have time to elle, elle find out all the code numbers the number you the figure used by Nancy is uh, 4000 over 4000 i made Nancy the I... contact with the Vietnamese medical doctors and I asked them why they uh, had to put the code number and why didn't they clean everything at the time. I have, I have the video clips to verify that those uh, Vietnamese medical doctors came in uh, a group of uh, three and four. They came to count uh, the bones, not to make the analysis. Those uh, Vietnamese medical doctors came to see if uh, the remains were consistent with those who died at two slangs. They clean the bones. They soak the bones to get the dust and dirt out. But some bones uh, still had uh, mud at the time. As I said, I have the video documents, documentaries uh, at the Ministry of Fine Arts and uh, Propaganda and Culture. Those medical doctors came to clean the bones sont venus nettoyer les ossements. And then uh, dry in the sun. After that, they put the numbers. Puis ils ont étiqueté. And they may have the reason that uh, those medical doctors uh, put the number on the skull uh, is that they were afraid that they would confuse uh, the skull and bones when they counted those again. President, uh, let me inform the parties that uh, yesterday I told the graduate to prepare the documents for documents, the expert, but since there are large number, of the, the numbers are large in the documents are large in number, so we cannot uh, prepare the documents ready for the expert. Therefore, the chamber advises parties to use uh, the approaches that uh, they have Dans comply with in the previous times. La démarche they qui should a toujours print été présent. the concerned pages of documents and then uh, given to the expert uh, to get the answer. And also, if possible, they can ask to, to show those possible. pages of documents on the screens. Il est également judicieux de faire projeter la page considérée à l'écran. Which are not in the case file for the basis, and I advise that the experts should not use those documents if they are not in the case file. In addition to that, for the outre, clear basis of your evidence, uh, the experts can use the photos, for example, and the, those photos should be photos given to the chamber. After you have shown those photos, the chamber photos, will then uh, I, uh, give the number to those photos. And now the floor is given back to the council Copper to return the questioning. Um, I, I believe um, Mr. Expert, you were referring to um, Vietnamese documents that are not only on the case file, but uh, it seems that nobody uh, knows where they are. But to finish this subject, um, this report from uh, this New Zealand scientist refers to her conversation with you about the unclarity. Uh, and, and she writes, um, uh, this catalogue 
with the numbers may not exist. Ce catalogue or it may be that the catalogue is, is among peut lost pas, documents peut from the time. Catalogue figure parmi les she says there's no way to understand what the identification numbers refer to quoi les according de to Mr. Vunvuti. Selon Monsieur Vunvuti, selon l'expérience de Monsieur Vunvuti, lorsque um, let, let, let me summarize it. Je vais She's saying that her information Elle that they only went up to 4,576 is based on what you told her. Um, and she writes au sujet du chiffre de 4, that the confusion about the number of crania was also cited in papers by uh, foreign researchers like uh, uh, Hughes, Hughes, Hughes la Hinton, sur le nombre de crânes, um, également um, cité, cité dans so, uh, des exposés de chercheurs étrangers, you, des publications de chercheurs étrangers um, tels que Lintan, et d'autres. Elle dit qu'elle ne sait pas pourquoi le comptage s'est arrêté à 4516. Uh, Est-ce que les Vietnamiens ont procédé à un catalogage en 1988, etc. Est-ce exact But uh, At the time, she uh, came for a fortnight and Réponse we had discussions. Pour une quinzaine de jours à l'époque, et nous avons Sometimes discuté. Sometimes we were asked questions, but those questions were uh, not complete. Uh, we didn't questions, know how she uh, made such a conclusion. Et je ne sais pas for example, she asked about uh, when the cranny uh, was cleaned. Quand est-ce que les crânes ont été nettoyés Que le nombre maximal était de so plus de 4000 ce jour-là. Jour elle n'a pas posé des questions her, uh, sur tous les éléments visit. du contexte, mais elle en a choisi In certains fact, au cours de sa visite. The, uh, that we removed from en fait, the, uh, stupa, les we removed restes self enlevés by self. du stupa long été so that, uh, this would not interrupt the flow of étape. visitors to the super and sometimes for each self there could be 300 to 400 remains but other selves could have 700 étagères, remains and restes, when she came to visit her in later part of the year she asked only about that particular number of the remains on that day visite, and I agree with uh, what he said d'ossements retrouvés uh, pour la journée. Add, uh, je vais ajouter un point. Le président a dit que si je veux présenter book document, des éléments de preuve, we were, uh, il faudrait uh, donner photo, des références uh, ou de l'ouvrage ou de livres. Lorsque the nous travaillons à Chungek, il y avait cette photo pit, indiquant le nombre pits, de fosses, 129 fosses, et le nombre de victimes, 8985. Cette photo nous fait donc apparaître le nombre de fosses et des ossements. Ce n'est pas l'original, c'est une copie. L'original est conservé à Chang'e. Photo shows the Comme number dis, of pits as well as the number of remains which were stored at the wooden stopa. In which case, I suggest to put on the record that this photo will be annexed, a copy of this photo will be annexed to the record as annex or exhibit A. And please, one of the uh, graphies takes a photo, puts an A on the back, and we attach it to the record. Um, My last Le greffier veut bien about, prendre um, cette photo pour l'annexer uh, au dos to, um, Ek, uh, Mr. De, um, du dossier tel que annexé. Not only did you um, preserve 6,426 um, Monsieur le témoin, non seulement uh, vous avez conservé, vous avez conservé 6,426 crânes, d'après ce que vous dites, mais dans votre rapport E3 bar 10,765, um, that um, a total number of uh, 63,112 uh, other skeletal elements uh, uh, were uh, preserved. Ont été Let me repeat that number, 63,112. Um, 
Now, as I said before, I'm a simple lawyer and certainly not any one who has any knowledge of um, anatomy. But um, if it's correct what I'm saying, please correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, a human body uh, has 206 bones altogether. Now, if 6,426 human remains Alors, were, were found that would lead ont été to theoretically a number Th of skeletal of bones that should have been found 1,323,000 344 bones. Now if you take Councillor, please repeat uh, the number again. Le président, yes, um, 6,426 times 206 is 1,323,344. Is that is only 4.77% uh, of Cela ne représente que 1,117% de tous les ossements qui auraient pu être retrouvés. Si ma calculation est correcte, pouvez-vous expliquer pourquoi on a retrouvé qu'une si infime partie des éléments du squelette humain réponse en fait ce n'était pas juste un ciseau retrouvé après analyse médico légale et conservation nous avons retrouvé 6426 d'autres ossements That is 63,112, and this number is already included in the summary of list. As uh, for the discrepancy of the number of bones and the skulls, indeed, uh, each human body composes of various uh, bones. And as I testified yesterday, during the excavation, only large bones and skulls were excavated, and the smaller bones, including phalanges, that is, those are small, finger bones or ribs, And if you refer doigts, to the list, you could see that si there were only a small number liste, of ribs, rib que, bones. Uh, uh, if you refer to the number of rib bones, it means that the total number of uh, human remains will be small. Later on, the government prohibited any further excavation. Réduit. And to Le present, a interdit we actually tried to de procéder excavate à de one pit, but we Nous have not obtained the permission yet. So, uh, the number, of, uh, the number of the bones that you mentioned is different uh, from the number that we have. Because of this factor, and we also mentioned the analysis of the Uh, left and the right side of the human remains. Uh, les ossements, and le côté droit all et these gauche. figures is included in the, the list. Des For example, the thigh, the right side, la liste, par exemple, that is 6,717. As for the left thigh, Pour bones, The figure is only 6,673. Uh, so you can see the discrepancy Because for le chiffre de 6,673. Each human uh, body, there should be the, uh, the approximate figures for the left or the right femur, but in fact, so we have a discrepancy on in the number. Pu, on aurait dû avoir le même chiffre pour le fémur droit et gauche, um, mais dans les chiffres, il y a une that, disparité. Uh, explanation, um, Maître Mr. Coupé, Mr. Expert. merci Now, pour ces explications, um, Monsieur l'Espère. The underlying assumption of all your work L'hypothèse qui sous-tend tout votre travail que vous avez initié en 2013 est que les crânes et les ossements que vous avez retrouvés 
provenaient des charniers de Tchangek. Est-ce exact Répondez tout simplement par oui ou par non pour essayer d'avancer rapidement. Réponse. Après l'analyse médico-légale, tous les ossements ont été exhumés des fosses à différents endroits sur le site de crimes de Tchangek. Question, ce n'est pas vrai, n'est-ce pas Car vous avez pris les crânes des stupas, du stupa. Vous ne les avez pas exhumés des fosses. Ces ossements se trouvaient déjà dans le stupa. Est-ce exact Réponse En effet, nous avons pris les ossements du stupa, mais hier j'étais devant la chambre had uh, mud stains que ces, ces besides the uh, cranium uh, cleansed by the Vietnamese medical team, there were still traces of a mud, mud that is mud from the area. And we actually compared the mud sample Nous as what I testified yesterday. De boue, comme je dit I myself hier. did not take those uh, cranium from the graves, but we conducted our analysis in order to avoid uh, being mené nos analyses. Light or cheated by other or who would bring scars or remains from elsewhere. Because I myself was one of the victims. That's why we had to be very careful in our forensic analysis. And for those remains, we took from the stupa, and if you refer to our digital database, we had photographs of those remains or scars before we washed and after we cleansed them. Avant de les nettoyer et de les laver. Question. Je vais vous donner un exemple. Un exemple hypothétique. Je ne dis pas que c'est vrai. Pas du tout. Mais présumons ce qui suit. Si les soldats communistes vietnamiens étaient impliqués dans les exécutions avant 1975, Exécution de soldats de l'Onnol. Et s'ils avaient enterré tous les corps de ces soldats de l'Onnol dans un Then, in site de charny particulier. Et puis, en 1981, ou 1981, ces crânes et ossements ont été exhumés the skulls and remains et ajoutés à ceux retrouvés à Changek. Is that something that your study could preclude? Is a possibility envisaged in your study? Or no? The question is objectionable. I'm not. Counsel can put hypotheticals to to the expert witness, but they have to have some basis in. Reality, there's absolutely no um, basis to put to this expert um, that Vietnamese people killed Lon Nol soldiers before 1975 and put them in Chiang Ek. Uh, it's, it's absurd. So you can put hypotheticals, but they have to have some basis in, in reality. Et pu être intégré à Chiang Ek. Ce n'est pas une base dans la réalité. Question. Réponse. Je ne dis pas que c'était vrai, c'est un scénario hypothétique. Les charniers, avant 1975, ma seule question est la suivante. Votre étude excluait-elle la possibilité que les autorités vietnamiennes aient ajouté des crânes ou des ossements venus d'ailleurs you said yourself, this is an issue of, of great concern for yourself as well. So my question is, can you scientifically exclude that possibility? My question is, is that this possibility can be excluded scientifically? If yes, how? Thank you. In order to clarify the matter once and for all, 
pour préciser ce point une fois pour toutes, Our team was even more careful than notre you. équipe a fait Because même plus attention que vous-même. Le était un ancien cimetière chinois. The Chinese Association has their grave sites there, and that's uh, brought into our careful attention. And in your hypothesis, that if people were killed outside, and then the, 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 the bones were included, then uh, the question that you would ask me, how would I know? And our analysis was based on the formula, not just uh, something or a fantasy. Regarding a human remain yesterday, regarding a person Je without any uh, torturing, without traces of a torture or mark, we actually invited an expert from outside to analyze why there was no such mark on that uh, skeletal uh, remain. Un pour As for pour the, the remains, remains of all de victims during the Khmer Rouge regime, they had uh, uh, pour tous les marks of sous. wounds. Le régime Khmer Rouge, that ce is the uh, mass of uh, being uh, killed and mass of being uh, tortured. De, in de particular at uh, Chiang Ai Center, the majority of the remains of the victims, they were uh, killed as a result of being hit at the base of the neck. Coup, and in order to ensure that the, the victims uh, would be dead, then they would hit the victims, victims uh, somewhere else. Elle frappait, Namely by uh, slitting the road par égorgement, par exemple, en leur tranchant la gorge. And that after the victims were killed, they slit the roads of the victims as well. Après Initially, we did not believe that. Tués, on leur tranchait la gorge au départ. Then on we ne called Hom Hoi to ask Puis whether such events are true place. And si Hom Hoi confirms that after the victims were killed, in order to ensure that they were really dead, then they slit over uh, their throats over Slit, on leur and the clothes were removed. Et leurs vêtements and that is the evidence that uh, no other uh, corpses could be brought in from outside. Ceci est la preuve au and you may ask me if the people would be uh, killed and their throats uh, slit from outside and were brought in. Maintenant, then we could also analyze that si uh, whether those, those were uh, newly emerged. Et égorgé, alors on pourrait analyser leurs ossements et les cartographier. D'abord, vous n'avez pas répondu à ma question. Euh, Visant à établir comment on pouvait établir l'existence de produits chimiques venus du sol. Deuxièmement, il ne s'agit pas d'une pure fantaisie, comme semble le dire le procureur. Mais euh, si um, je le dis, c'est par rapport à ce qui ressort de votre um, document E3-10-765. Car dans ce document, um, the various forms of vous décrivez trauma les différentes formes discovered. de traumatisme violent and point eight and point nine, retrouvées ou décelées. Au point 8 ou point 9, uh, that there were vous dites 1686 marks of shooting with bullets Il y avait 1686 marques de balles d'exécution de, par balles ou par euh, culasse de fusil 990 marks 9, of piercing with bayonets 999 Now, ma uh, marques spoke to him, Hui, d'exécution par bayonnette vous avez parlé à Hui about killing il n'a pas dit qu'il y ait des exécutions à Chang Eck par balle ou par bayonnette. Et encore moins, so une question, autre personne, un bourreau, um, qui a témoigné devant la chambre. Chang Eck. Ma question est la suivante. D'après l'analyse chimique du sol, comment pouvez-vous déterminer que les crânes et euh, les ossements n'ont pas été ajoutés par les Vietnamiens ou alors appartenaient en fait, euh, se trouvaient déjà sur le cimetière chinois Um, Mr. President, I, I ask that council ask clear, clear questions here. He, he started this very long question by saying that the witness hadn't answered his, his prior question. His prior question wasn't 
at all asking the witness to explain this uh, testing the process for testing the mud samples. That's not what he asked at all. He's never even asked the witness that, so he shouldn't be saying he didn't ask that. If he wants to ask the witness to explain how they analyzed the mud samples, that's a very simple question. Um, if he wants an explanation of the number given, um, that is not just the shootings, but is uh, also uh, references uh, evidence of the use of cleaning rods of rifles, you should ask them for an explanation of that. But he shouldn't throw this all up and then put to him some conspiracy question about the Vietnamese. He should ask clear, simple questions to this witness. Um, in, in itself, I agree with the prosecution. However, um, in your wisdom, Mr. President, you decided to only um, allot uh, one and a half session to us. So uh, the question is a bit convoluted. I, 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 I agree. Um, but in the time that I have, I try to be as efficient um, as possible. It doesn't help necessarily with the result. Uh, 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 true, certainly not with these objections. Um, but I have no problem in breaking it down, and maybe we should do that after the break. Peut-être il faudrait poser des questions, plusieurs petites questions. Maître Coupeux, je n'ai pas de problème à le faire vu le temps qui nous est imparti, mais peut-être je pourrais le faire après la pause. Le président. And resume at 20 to Le moment 11. est opportun de prendre une pause pour reprendre à 10h40. L'audience est suspendue.